Morning, YouTube. Nice little Deccan job today. Just took delivery of the um, Deccan, which Phil is... <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, I think that's an edit. Right. <laughs> nice little decking job we're going to do today. We just took the delivery of the decking there and some soil because we've done some raised beds. We have had a little video out on that. If you've not seen that, uh, take a look at that. We just we haven't finished it, so we're going to put that soil for it. So. Actually, I can't tell you to look at it because we haven't finished the video. So when it's up, have a look at it, check it out. So yeah, just get this in the back and we'll show you what we're doing in the back. So, this is where we're going to be decking. The shed's coming down, take that down today and um, see what we can do with the floor. The concrete's staying in. We're going to come up to step step level and then we're going to come to this post here come straight along basically where the concrete is now so the shed's going and then all that's going to be decked and we're really looking forward to it this is one of our maintenance jobs we haven't put this one up on video yet but this was a from scratch to maintenance so this will be a good job to do and there's the raised bed down there that i was talking about but we haven't finished the video on that so there's plenty to come and we'll turn you off for now. Just laying some of the joists out to give us ourselves an idea of the size. I mean, we use about 18 inch between them, so this isn't set out. Sometimes when the space is tight, it's easy to make the frame in another area of uh, another area of the garden and then just bring it in, which is what we've done here. And then we'll just fit it levelly and go from that one. That'll be one of our first levels. This trellis works going up on the right hand side and we're only putting three pieces up but the squares are so big I don't like the big squares so we've bought six trellises and then we're going to dismantle three of them and then make up three with smaller squares I think it looks a lot better so we'll just get the posts in now ready for the trellis work and then we'll start taking them apart Nail gun is very uh, invaluable on this type of job. 
brilliant tool. But the best tool you need in your toolkit is this, the little Curly Whaley. <laughs> and we're standing on the dark side of the decking, looking over at the light side of the decking. And we take a couple of paces, just simply turn around. And now we're standing on the dark side, looking at the light side again. So even when we do decking, we get stripes in it. Not just our lawns, you know. Another great tool, the track saw for getting straight lines. Brilliant little tool. And we've got the trellis up at the moment, but we've got to attach the battens we dismantled. So we've finished the decking and we'll just go out and see if it makes a difference. Well, I should cocoa. And the trellis work is doubled up instead of being a six inch, five and a half, it's a six inch square. It's now, I don't know what that is, inch and a half square. Um, and here we have the deck, which we're very pleased with. Nice mate. to go and if you've enjoyed this uh, give us a thumb up and I hope you have enjoyed it and please subscribe and thanks very much for watching and we'll see you on the next one